it socked into right field off the bat of Ramirez, but Verdugo will make that catch one away. And it with a base hit and a stolen base in the second inning. They stole one in the first game, so they made it 20. Good vertical drop on that cutter and the slider. Got good bite on it. Good giddy up on that heater at 95. Yeah. Great. Liner, that'll be caught. Valdez with the grab. They go one, two, three. And drops in a strike. Center. And line of the corner. All the way up against the base of the monster. That's uh, hard in the second. Looking to bunt. Did not offer. The sheer number of things that are brand new to him. And it's getting low. Their fan base is epic. Lau will make the play. Down to third goes Yoshida. Country and around the world. Tapia looking to strike. He whiffed in the second. Infield in. Right. We're talking about a swing and a miss here by Tapia. He comes up empty. 0 oh, 2. Another big swing. He comes up empty again on that curveball. He strikes out. Do it. He tags that one to left. Can't get it. It's off the walls in. Margot still. He's 0 for 1. Sox doing that a couple times. Showing even. Isak Paredes is 0 for 1. He's lying to right. And then. Afternoon here at the ballpark. That's going to be ball four. Red Sox issue their face gesture there by a young fan as Margot is coming to the on deck area. Walls is 0 for 1. He struck out in the second. You know, as a fan, though, if the team. I'm only asking that because I disagree. I don't care either way. I'm still mad. My team's out. <laughs> yeah. Three and one. That's going to be ball four. Walk back to back guys. He takes a ball. Guys are go showing no bunt. Looks at a strike. First. Two and one. Walks. He was tempted but held off it. Went for it, three and two. Another one popped back out of play. Three two, and he put him away. It's a big K for Garza. Second, he's 0 for one, and a strike. And through for a base hit. Berrettis hitting third. They put on the brakes. 309 with 12 homers. He's driven in 33. Round ball in the first. Casa is firing home in time. They got the up. Guy who hit 39 home runs two years. That's a strike. Two and two. Three and two. He struck him out. How about that? They loaded the bases with one down, but here, and it was fascinating. I was thinking about you as Jaron Duran went back into the center field fence. He, you know, it, it, the configuration of the park is still the same, but. Skipped into right field, and that'll be a hit here for Val. This off before you get onto the field to figure out how many steps you can take full speed before you run into something. Mm -hmm. And what the guys do here, he got his shoulder over there, so he didn't kill himself. But if you mismanage it and you leave it there, you're first as Freddie Lynn joins us here in the broadcast booth. How about you know the other ballpark? It was solid, so it looked like it was wood, but it really played like concrete. Um, Kansas City was the same way. Up, keep them standing. So you had to know where those things were. 
High chopper glides on will handle that. Bit of a high throw. Here that I hit with my shoulder. You know, that comes from football. And, you know, I'd leave with my right side, and I never hit my head. Shoulder started to give me some problems when I was playing golf. And I'm thinking, damn, that's a shoulder I hit every wall with. Right. And when I played football. Any shoulder issues ever, really. You know, a little bit of arm, like, fatigue down, like, down the arm a little Davey, bit. look at him. Against Tampa Bay. After winning game one, Rafi coming up empty on the slider. And the slider's been giving guys a height. And then you could you could battle it out of there. But if you're trying to pull it, you go right over the top. Yeah, explain to that, too. Like, you know, you don't. With two down, and he's going to take another walk. And we've talked about this in game one. He's been walking a lot. Into game seven. And when Joe Morgan came up uh, with the man on second uh, late in the game, it's ninth inning. I can't get to it. I catch it on one hop. That's the game-winning hit. We lose four to three. We lose game seven because our field's a quagmire. Oh. <laughs> we have to beat these guys. Line shot that's fair. Off the short fence. It bounds back to Virginia. I was just happy to be a part of it. Oh, one players, after another, yeah. These players are lucky because they got this amazing drainage system. Manicure. It, oh, my gosh. It's my, in my rookie year, it was, it was still crowned. That's right. And Wrigley was crowned. Was that we played on in the 70s. Runner goes and the throw. Jump. He's yeah, he got a good jump, and he's safely in. They continue to steal bait. And, and whoever beats them over gonna earn yeah, it. Yeah, that's right. I mean, Popped up Devers coming up. And and so for me it was a, it was a great game, but I, I don't care about it. I want to win this game. Yeah. You know, Pete's going, oh, this is great. You know, he was involved but not as much. So the downtime for commercials and things wasn't as, as great as it is now. He finally with a 3-1. And he walked him. So that's going to load up the bases. In there for a strike on Margot, who's doubled, run into the wall, and struck out. But he ever did. Waved at and missed, and it's 0 2. They might for a pitch. I mean, there were a couple. Uh, J.R. Richard. That's right, J.R. Richard. Wow. Popped up. And then wow. infield flying. Jim Ed. I mean, just his clothing alone wins that game. <laughs> Quite another low hit game, incidentally. Sox have only four Tampa Bay just five, six or seven times. You know, the things you think about as a young fan of, you know, nine, ten years old. Childhood in baseball, there's so many good stories, right? Sure. Yep. Pitch down the dirt, swung on and missed, and Mejia will come up with a strikeout. Two to one, Tampa. Quite another low hit game, incidentally. Sox have only four Tampa Bay just five, six or seven times. You know, the things you think about as a young fan of, you know, nine, ten years old. Childhood in baseball, there's so many good stories, right? Sure. Yep. Pitch down the dirt, swung on and missed, and Mejia will come up with a strikeout. Two to one, Tampa.